Hello everyone, we have already discussed permutations and combinations that is Kramche and Sanche. We can also generate all the possible permutations and combinations uh, like there is an algorithm for generation of permutation based on lexicographic ordering. So lexicographic ordering is like uh, we store the uh, words in dictionary in the alphabetical order. So we have algorithm, uh, algorithm says like if we have given a natural number n and list the n factorial permutations of given n distinct objects say 1, 2, 3 and so on in the ascending order. So let capital C equals to 1 print first permutation as 1, 2, 3 and so on. If n equals to 1 then go to step 3. So we have to stop it. Let total count equals to n factorial which is n into n minus 1 into n minus 2 and so on 1. So for c equals to 2 to total count total permutations generate next permutation from given permutation a1, a2 and so on by following steps given below. So first step we have to scan the digits of given permutation from right to left and note the first consecutive pair an minus 1 and an such that an minus 1 less than an. So suppose we have the digits 1, 2, 3, 4. So we have digits 1, 2, 3, 4. So what we have to do, scan the digits of given permutation from right to left and note the first consecutive pair an minus 1 and an such that an minus 1 is less than an. So we have to scan from right to left and we have to check whether an minus 1 is less than an. So this is an. And this is an minus 1. So here the condition is true that an minus 1, 3 is less than 4. So this is an minus 1 position and this is an position. Then remember the position of an minus 1. Let m equals to n minus 1. Okay, m equals to n minus 1. So this is the position m. So next search for the smallest digit among digits am plus 1, am plus 2 and so on. So this would be am plus 1 digit. So this is this would be m plus 1 location and so on that is larger than am. That is larger than am. Call it x. So 4 is larger than am. am is 3. So call it x. So x equals to 4. Interchange am and x. Interchange am and x. So am is 3 and x is 4. So what we have to do? We have to interchange it. So 1, 2, 4, 3. Arrange all digits am plus 1 to an in increasing order. So am plus 1 position is here. to an an in increasing order as an plus 1 less than an plus 2 and less than an so we don't have any further digits so print a1 a2 up to n so this would be the next number 1 2 3 4 and next number would be 1 2 4 3 so let's take another example. Suppose we have the digits 1, 3, 2, 4, 1 and we have to find the next permutation. So we have to scan from right to left. So this is an, this is an minus 1. So an minus 1 is not less than an. Then again we have to uh, find next pair. So 2 is less than 4. So this is m position and this is 
and plus one position. So we have to next search for the smallest digit among digits am plus one, am plus two, and so on am that is larger than am. So which is larger than smallest digit among these which is larger than am. So this is 4, call it x, so x equals to 4. So interchange am and x, so you have to interchange this, so 1, 3, 4, 2, 1. So this position is m, now this is m plus 1 position now. Then arrange all digits am plus 1 to an. So am plus 1 to an in increasing order as am plus 1 less than am plus 2 less than am. So we have to arrange this. So this would be 1, 3, 4, 1, 2. So this is the next permutation after this. So like permutations we can also generate combinations. So there is algorithm select k objects out of n distinct objects say 1 2 3 4 up to n list all n digits in ascending order. So this algorithms also work on lexicographing order. Select first k digit print them j equals to 1 2 up to k be index on k elements then assign maximum value to each jth position as n minus k plus j suppose we have the number 1 2 3 4 or we have to find the combinations of three elements three numbers so out of 4 we have to find the combinations of 3 numbers. So n minus k plus j would be n equals to 4 here and k equals to 3 here. So n minus k plus j would be 4 minus 3 plus j is here from 1, 2 and 3. So j would be 1, 2 and 3 and maximum would be 3. So 4 minus 3 plus 3 equals to 4. That is counting would be up to maximum 4. Start scanning the list from right to left. Stop at location where there are consecutive digits. So first we have to print the 3 numbers like 1, 2, 3. Then start scanning the list from right to left. Stop at location where there are consecutive digits such as an minus 1 less than an. Let m equals to n minus 1. So here this position is m. If no such pair is found, go to step that we have to stop otherwise leave the digits before am as they were follow am by a, am plus 1 am plus 2 and until k digits in all have been listed down so you have to find all digits such that no digit crosses the limit assigned as in step 4 that is n minus k plus j so we have 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 already so next element would be that that would be 4 again we have to scan the list from right to left so we are here now so what we have to do so 2 can be replaced with 3 then again we will further move So this one can be replaced by 2. So these are the total 4 combinations. So as we know NCR is so n equals to 4 
and r equals to 3 n factorial by r factorial into n minus r factorial that is 4 minus 3 factorial which is 4 so we have total 4 combinations